So my journey starts here. I am on Bradley and uh, Holden in Staten Island, New York. Headed out to Bayonne to do uh, uh, a, a scenic ride, pretty long ride, and uh, document the process. Uh, so come along for the ride. Yo, where you at? I, I am home. Where are you? <laughs> okay, I am at the midpoint of the Bayonne Bridge crossing. I'm enjoying the view right now, and I'm working my way towards you. Or if you want to meet me by the uh, end of the bridge, it's up to you. Uh, yeah, I go. I go into you then. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I'll see you in a little bit. Alright, so so far I have traveled uh, 6.4 miles. When I left the house, the bike was not fully charged. The bike was resting at 83.2 volts. I guess a full charge technically would be considered 84 volts. So within the six and almost seven miles that I've driven, uh, that's how much I've drank, uh, 81.6. Hello! <laughs> All right, so I am here with... Electric Santito on Instagram. And what are you riding? Super 73 RX, modified by Powerful Lithium. So you say it's modified, what do you have on this thing? All right, so we're running the five kilowatt motor, uh, 51 amp hour, Powerful Lithium battery. 72 volts, right? 72 volts, uh, 80 amp Sabaton controller tuned by V. I got the nice Tapia seat with the personalized Santito on it. Pro tape for handlebars. Some headlights that I I uh, ran into on Amazon. <laughs> uh, special met bracket made by V at Powerful Lithium. Sick. And uh, I tell you what, between V and Mac Mittens, this bike has become a reality. Uh -oh. So this is your dream build? Dream build. Right. Dream build. Thanks to... Uh, Mac the boys, the boys, Andy, definitely. And Andy, my boy Andy, can't forget can't my boy Andy. Andy. <laughs> wasabi, wasabi, <laughs> what is it? Wasabi, wabi. Wasabi, wabi. So far, this journey is taking me through the streets of Staten Island into New Jersey, through Bayonne, and uh, now I don't know where the hell he's taking me. degrees and sunny what happened so it is cold we are seeking refuge inside of a coffee shop called old cafe somewhere in hoboken and the bike's outside we'll be inside two hours later man i didn't show the coffee but the coffee was great I am warm and we are moving on. So I don't know what area we're passing, but these holes are beautiful. We are just near the uh, Lincoln Tunnel, I know I saw that. Whatever area this is, it's definitely up and coming. It is beautiful, nice place to live. View of the New York City skyline does not disappoint from the area of New Jersey. does a good job of representing what I'm seeing with my eyes. Alright, we've been riding for a little while. Oh, I am fucking
York is freezing. What happened to the nice weather, New York? All right, so hopefully we pull up to a rest spot soon. I gotta pee, and I'm fucking cold. Okay, so we covered 36.8 miles. I'm at 74.2 volts. Uh, we are running at a moderate speed of uh, around 40 miles per hour. And I'm not sure, even though this says we've been at it for 2 hours and 27 minutes, we, we I don't think we've been riding that long. No, well, right? No, we stopped. We did stop we stopped. for coffee. Yeah. Alright, so this is the midpoint and we'll be... Uh, are you hungry? Are you going to eat something? Yes. Maybe we'll grab some grub and then we'll shoot back and hit it a little harder. Yeah. Alright, so the sun is finally, finally Should I send out. it to... Right, the damn sun! The damn sun came out briefly! Briefly! Still go! But uh, we reached the midpoint, we turned around, we're heading back. 36 miles, almost 37 miles and counting. 74 volts. Let's go, baby! That looks so nice right now. Oh man, that's a nice shot. All right, so this is the spot we came to to take some pics. I got some good pics to show you right now. Enjoy that and it's off to the next spot. All right, off, off to the next spot. All right, so I am looking for a very clear rolling shot. So we found this little spot just outside of a golf course, and I'm going to try to get a nice rolling shot of this bad boy right here. All right, so you know the deal. You'll go down the road. Yeah. Here, you want me to hold that? Yeah. Put it. Get on my bike. Go down the road. Go down the road a little bit. Uh, when you're coming back towards me about 20, 25 miles an hour, I'll shoot. Just turn around when you can after you pass me and do it again. So you get a second try at it. Alright. <laughs> Alright, I got about five tries to get the perfect shot. And I think I got it. Uh, let's see what he thinks by his reaction. <laughs> oh, shit. Let's see this. All right, I was trying to get you to give the peace sign oh, when you was going by the last time. But let's try to do one more with the peace sign. Right. But I got a bunch that are really clear, bro. Hold that up. Oh my. Sick. <laughs> Sick. So we just saw it through here. Now it's your turn. Check this out. We're out of here. We are just about ready to call this ride. We're heading back home. At least it feels a little warmer. Oh, yeah. it feels great, actually. All right, so now we are by the GW Bridge. We are that much closer to home. I feel like I've been riding all day. As soon as we stop, I'll check the mileage. And right now, I'm at 69 volts. But I'm still going strong. Dangerously close. Judging by those bars, there's only two bars left. At throttle right now, I'm running at 63 volts. Uh, I'm concerned, but not too concerned. I think even though I'm still in New Jersey, I'll make it home. But as soon as I get a chance, I'm gonna pull over, see how many miles we've covered. Uh, don't know if I can see elevation just yet, but uh, stay tuned for that. This is probably the least amount of voltage that you've ever seen me ride in. I'm down to 62, 63 volts, but I am throttling. Uh, and the light is flashing right now. I'm getting dangerously close to this bad boy uh, well, to, for the controller to shut off. So we gotta get to Stefan and make it home ASAP. I might have to charge before I go home. A few miles, uh, 
I'm at 61 volts now. At throttle. Normal mode. 26 miles an hour. Although I think that's wrong. Might be more like 22 right now. I'm trying to conserve power. We're almost back. I think I'm gonna charge a little bit before I head home, but uh, I was really hoping I would make it all the way back. I guess we must have hit some really steep inclines. That's the only thing I can think of that would drain so much power. Uh, be nice to see the top speed, what it was today, as well as the, uh, the distance covered. I know we've at least covered 50 miles. As soon as we pull over, I'll check it out. But this is the current situation right now. Down to like 60 volts now. I'm giving it some throttle and it's dropping below 60. I'm expecting that controller cut off any volt now. I'm definitely not making it back to my house. So once I get to Santos' house, I'll charge for a little bit. Give myself enough to charge. You know. Dangerously close to that threshold. Dangerously. So we made it. We made it and let me break open the Relive app because the Relive app is about to end right now. I thought I'd make it all the way home, but I, I would be cutting it way too close. So rather than chance it, I'm going to charge here for a little bit before I bounce. Uh, let me see, where's my Relive app? All right, so holy shit, I did pretty good. I covered a total of 68.5 miles. That is awesome. And right now, let me see where she's resting at. Okay, I'm not throttling. She's at 60.2 volts, so that means I got a good five volts before she'll shut off. But I'm not chancing at getting home in five, with five volts. Uh, so I will be calling this one here. If you guys enjoyed this video, please don't hesitate and smash that like button. Leave a comment because I get back to everybody. And if you want, please subscribe. So until the next video, peace out, everybody.